Thailand. There's a total of 319 fights, 274 victories, 42 losses, and three draws. He's the 2013, or the first ever, Thai Fight Kachuk champion after a win against Sayok Pumpumwong. And uh, 2007, uh, the Fairtex Tepersa champion. A while back before he made his name for himself. Yeah, recently uh, re signed with Thai Fight. Performed very well in his uh, first outing back. Let's see what he's got here tonight. Oh, definitely. And it was a much more serious Switzer Kun than the last bout we saw him. I think we might see more of the same here. Beautiful low kicks there thrown from Switzer Kun after a beautiful combination. Well, on our last bout, we saw two 22 year olds going at it. This time, two 35 year olds. Could be more fair oh. than that. <laughs> Sneaky low kick there from Sutter Corn. It looked like he was going to pull the trigger on a right hand, and he went low. There it is again. Sutter Corn loves to fight like that. He loves to put the hand combinations together and finish off with a low kick. And there's that low kick again. Any fighter doesn't block the low kicks from Sutter Corn, he will make them, he will punish them. Without a shadow of a doubt, we've seen it on countless occasions. Good left hand there, and a the right hand coming in from Sutsukorn, and again, Another timing it to perfection. Beautiful hook there thrown from Sutsukorn. He must have been watching Sayok's fight early on today. <laughs> Maybe. Still pushing forward, Sutsukorn. Looking for that one too. We saw um, his brother Sinsamut earlier here today, so we know he's around ring ringside somewhere. Oh, definitely. And, and of course, another product of the Lindby family. And of course, you've got to include um, Rabba Somdead and Tupac there as well. Some very popular fighters within that one family. Beautiful combinations put together there from Sutsuk Gorn. Now he's doing a good job staying on his feet and tries to attack back, but receives another big right hand from oh. Sutsuk Gorn. Socking me. Solid right hands there from Sutsuk Gorn. And then combines it with a low kick. Well, Ari just not hitting back. Really needs to do something if he wants to get something out of this round here. I like that from Sutsukon, going low, switching levels. Looking for an elbow. Sutsukon looking like he's having a lot more fun in the ring right now. There's that right hand again. He's done so well to connect with his hands. I'm just impressed by how well his boxing has improved. And it's maybe fair to say he's had Ekapot as a trainer now. Ekapot saw kidding me once upon a time. I think the doctor's gonna have to take a look at the nose of uh, Sabalainen right now. It doesn't look that bad, but... Should be able to continue, but we're not the doctors. Unless we can get a camera, there we go. Yeah, he says okay. It's okay. <laughs> I've got to agree with him with my very little experience of being a doctor. <laughs> Zero is the answer. Oh, there's a slight cut on the top of the head now. Just where the doctors just checked. Yeah, good body shot again there from Sutsu Khan. Yeah, big body shots. And I believe Sutsu Khan will start going to the body now. That is how that it seems how Auri has reacted to it. Nice sweep there from Sutsu Khan. And it could be really demoralizing to get up from those sweeps. And the front one. Oh, hobbling back to the corner. Bloody and beaten. We'll see you in round two. Plays from the first round. Sutsa Gorn connecting very well with a lot of hands and a lot of good combinations. Of course, going for some of some fantastic low kicks as well. Ari just avoiding that elbow, but not that one. Ari, of course, in the very first round, cut in two different places from what I've seen. That must be the second cut. Here's that fantastic sweep that we saw towards the end of that first round. 
quite impressive um, from Savalainen to be able to stay on his feet and not get Absolutely, I think it's fair to say that Sister Coin took that first round without doubt. Of course, unofficially. <laughs> no, you can write that one down, that's okay. <laughs> Absolutely. Inside kick now to that damaged leg of Savalainen. Nice right hand there from Savalainen, actually connected, but Sutter Coin did not like that oh, one bit. He's, and he's hobbling on that left leg, Kevin. Sutter Coin's just going to go for it. He's just taking far too many low kicks, and if you don't block those low kicks, Sutter Coin is going to make you pay. He's going to continue punishing it, and why yeah. not? The referee, yep, yeah, having, the having a good look. Oh. <laughs> it was only in due time. I think that's it, yep. And that's a KO victory in the second round for Sutsakon. Very impressive Sock again. Me, yeah. once, once more by Sutsakon. A little bit of that handiwork. Or should I say leggy work in that second and final round. I mean, when he was going back to the corner in the first round, we could see that he was on one leg, and as they say, it's difficult to win on one leg. You've got to say, very well done for Jusak Gorn for understanding that he's taken enough punishment. He doesn't need any more. And what best way to have a for just dropping to the floor as well and realizing that's it. Enough's enough. Absolutely. It was only a matter of time. Those low kicks are absolutely lethal. And you won't be able to see it on the camera, but he is hobbling backstage right now with the help from uh, a couple of the doctors. Interesting, isn't it? Sayok looking amazing, and now Sutsukorn as well, rolling back the clock. They both definitely did. Maybe we can see a rematch, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but 10 years in the making, yeah? <laughs> Absolutely. Happy as ever. Sutsukorn. The winner! ขอแสดงความยินดีด้วยนะครับโอ้ยอดเยี่ยมมากๆฮะเป็นกําลังใจกับผู้ชนะนะครับแล้วก็เป็นกําลังใจกับผู้ที่พ่ายไปด้วย